hi everyone this is me bilal malik uh, in this video lecture i will uh, guide you how to design a digital dc uh, digital dc voltmeter uh, so digital dc watt meter using pic microcontroller so in this article i will only talk about dc watt meter and in my uh, coming uh, videos i will also uh, write or make a video about uh, ac watt meter but in this article i will only talk about dc watt meter as you know uh, dc power formula is v multiplied by i where v is dc voltage and i is dc current i have already posted uh, videos on uh, uh, dc voltmeter design and dc m meter design using pic microcontroller you can uh, check these videos uh, on my youtube channel i have also given the link of these videos in the description of uh, uh, this video you can watch them before watching this uh, video if you don't know how to design digital dc voltmeter or digital dc m meter using pic microcontroller because digital dc uh, watt meter uh, is only uh, uh, a product of uh, voltage and current if you know how to measure uh, dc voltage and how to measure dc current you can easily find dc power using uh, uh, using this formula so uh, this is a brief review of uh, dc power and uh, 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 let's go to the circuit diagram of uh, digital dc uh, watt meter and discuss it <coughs> this is the circuit diagram of uh, uh, digital dc watt meter and as you know we have connected uh, a 40 volt uh, 40 volt dc supply and uh, here we connected a m meter this is the load and uh, this is a, a shunt resistor uh, if you have any questions about shunt resistor uh, you can watch a video on uh, dc emitter design uh, description uh, link of uh, video is given in the description of this video and this is uh, uh, basically a shunt resistor because microcontroller uh, cannot measure uh, voltage is more than 5 volts so we uh, use shunt uh, we use voltage divider to step down this voltage to less than uh, 5 volts so this is uh, a voltage divider as you know voltage divider basically uh, uh, step down the voltage by using this formula as you know if you are uh, engineering student you, you definitely know about this formula and we use this shunt resistor to uh, measure uh, current because microcontroller cannot measure uh, current uh, directly so it can only measure voltage with the help of built-in adc so we basically we are uh, measuring voltage uh, across this shunt resistor and by using uh, ohm law we can easily convert uh, this voltage uh, uh, measured voltage back into current using uh, ohm law uh, ohm law formula according to this formula if we, if we measured voltage uh, with the help of ADC across this resistor and we know the value of this resistor that is 0.47 ohm so we can calculate current uh, with this formula so microcontroller will measure uh, uh, 
battery voltage with the help of uh, voltage divider and uh, current with the help of shunt resistor so we can easily calculate dc power using uh, this formula v dc multiply by i dc i dc will come from this formula and v dc will, will we will measure from this formula and uh, uh, after bearing a DC value so uh, this is a basic circle diagram of digital DC uh, watt meter if you want to measure high currents uh, if you want to design uh, uh, DC watt meter for high a uh, voltage for high watt uh, watt rating so you have to use uh, uh, an, uh, some kind of current sensor for example uh, Hall effect sensor because uh, we cannot measure high currents with the help of shunt resistor the reason uh, basic reason is uh, uh, because uh, there, uh, higher the current the higher will be the losses across the shunt resistor you know uh, as this uh, loss across a shunt resistor for, uh, will be p is equal to i square r so this is the uh, this is the value of shunt resistor higher will the current the higher will be the power losses if for example we are measuring 10 uh, ampere so 10 to square uh, uh, will be 100 100 multiplied by 0.47 it will be 0.4.7 watt so a uh, 4.7 watt uh, is not uh, a very uh, big drop for uh, 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 high power applications but in case of low power application it is huge loss so if you uh, similarly if you want to make 100 ampere so losses will be 470 watt so in this way losses will uh, keep increasing so if you want to make uh, design watt uh, high rating uh, watt meter you should use uh, some kind of uh, current sensor that is Hall effect sensor current sensor that's all there are many sensors available in market so now let's check the uh, uh, simulation of uh, uh, digital dc watt meter i have designed uh, this circuit in proteus so let's run the simulation <coughs> yes as you know uh, first of all lcd will display digital watt meter uh, i have also given a link of uh, uh, how to interface lcd with pic microcontroller if you don't know you can check this uh, you can check this article from my blog microcontrollerslab.com as you know uh, current through this circuit is 3.82 and uh, uh, we have just connected this ammeter just to verify our results and uh, uh, dc voltage is 40 uh, 40 volts so 40 multiplied by 3.82 be equal to 148 watt this is the basic uh, circuit diagram for digital dc watt meter so uh, to design a digital dc watt meter uh, what you uh, what uh, thing you should uh, 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 what thing you should uh, uh, remember you should know how to interface lcd with microcontroller how to uh, measure voltage using adc or pic microcontroller you if you don't know you can uh, read more about it uh, from my website microcontrollerslab.com i have also uh, given a link of uh, uh, lcd interfacing adc interfacing uh, and uh, digital dc voltmeter digital dc ammeter on my uh, on the dis in the description of this video so thanks for watching this video if you have any question let me know with your comments love is